Hi YouTubers, RV Debs here with you. It is Friday and I'm wearing another new blouse I bought. It's got the cutout shoulders because it gets hot here in Texas. It sure does. I'm in my workspace because I have to for sure make some earrings. I bought, um, it's Nadia's birthday. Nadia, if you ever see my videos that have the three little boys that I adore, I'm their bubby. And um, it's her birthday this Saturday, which is tonight. And we're having dinner at her mom's. And everyone, I, I wanted to get her presents. And she is definitely a beautiful mom and woman. And um, normally I just make her necklaces, but I've made her necklaces. And uh, so um, I decided I would make her earrings. But I also bought her a couple books. Um, this is a journal. And it's Walk by Faith, Not by Sight. So she can write her feelings down or whatever. And then I also bought her a little book that's cute. It's called Love Notes for Kids. And she can, I don't know, she could do whatever she wants, but you know, you can take them out of here and put them in your children's lunch or under their pillow or on their pillow. You know, it's, it's a nice little thing, I thought. And then I also got her some turquoise crosses to, for the bottom of the earrings that I'm about to make. Um, she wears a lot of uh, soft, tanny, beigey kind of stuff. I've already given her, you know, a necklace similar to this one. This is a, this is a new necklace that I put on Etsy recently. It's um, a little shorter. I have two necklaces in a similar color scheme. And you can see... Oh, well, these are both about the same, actually. Okay. <laughs> anyway, one has little um, little leaves and these beads that I had gotten. And it also has really pretty shell beads that I love. And uh, it's pretty nice. I like it a lot. I am going to make the earrings now, but yesterday I made a necklace out of a lot of the new beads I bought. I always have to do that. It's turquoise. It's got a lot of beads I got. There's like little turquoise leaves. I've got, those are pretty. I don't know if I've shown you this one or not. This has a lot of teal on it, but it also has purples and royal blue or electric blue, cobalt blue. So it's, that's the end. It's, you'll find that when I have a little knot, sometimes it's apparent, sometimes you can't even find it. But then it, the rest of them are like just different colors of teal, blue, green, purple. Um, and it's a very pretty necklace too. All right, I just finished Nadia's um, birthday earrings. <laughs> I'll show you how they turned out. Well, one at a time, I guess. Cause she wears, she wears a lot of these colors. Real cute. Hey, it's very, fits around a long time. It's a good thing it doesn't go bad after a while. Say hi, because I'm recording. Oh, hi. Hi. Hi, y'all. Kathy, I'm going to have to take a picture, or at least a video of it. She just finished a painting, and it's a picture that uh, Nadia wanted her. It was a, something that she showed both of us. It was like a hint, hint, <laughs> months ago. Nathan thinks it was a surprise, but I said, uh-uh. <laughs> and uh, it turned out really good. It's a picture of a painting of um, a female deer, a doe, a, doe, a, deer, a deer, a doe, a doe with, um, and it's kind of whimsical and it has flowers all around the head, you know, just really cute. And hers looks much better than the one that we were showed. So, shown. Shown? I think I had to put a couple of rhinestones. 
Like no, sparkle? I think okay. it looks good like it is. All right. Yeah, I mean, it just doesn't need anything. No, I don't think so. So, we are just busy little artistos. <laughs> and now I'm going to, uh, I don't know, maybe I'll make another pair of earrings. I have like two other earrings in my mind to make. But these did turn out really cute. Because she wears a lot of the beiges, the golds and tans, and the turquoise too. So, done. Talk to you guys soon. Friends and family. It's RV Dubs and it's Saturday. About, I think it's like 2 in the afternoon. Very lazy day. I've been watching the royal wedding. Which is so cool. And uh, Rosie sat at the front door like she had to go out, but then she, I let her out and she sits down on the lawn chair. But little Lily takes herself for a little walk around. Oh, good morning, everyone. It is Sunday. Sunday morning, around 10.30. And... All she's barking at is an old man across the street. That guy. Hey, hey, be nice. Don't have an attitude, Lily. It's a beautiful day. This is Sunday afternoon around 6 p.m. It's been the prettiest day. It's not hot. Yeah. Come on, Rose. Come on, Lily. Okay, this is my dinner. I thought I'd just show you what I made. That is avocado smushed with um, garlic, salt, pepper, and a little bit of hot sauce on it. And these are spicy chicken burgers made out of soy and veggies. It's a veggie burger, but it's like a chicken. Spicy chicken is the name of it. Well, I grilled some onions with it and a bunch of broccoli with lemon juice and seasonings. And that's my dinner, and I'm going to enjoy it, I hope. So I just thought I would share this little tiny bit with you guys. Good afternoon, YouTubers. It is Monday, about quarter to noon, 11.43 to be exact. Kat and I are headed to uh, a little town called Haskell, which is the closest to get groceries. I, need, I hope they have sprouts, because that's what I want. Anyway, uh, yeah, so we're getting ready to She's not here. Well, she's now she's here. Welcome. So I was just telling the YouTubers we're headed to a little town to get our groceries. I just need fresh vegetables. Yeah, I do too. It's exactly what I need. Yeah. And, you know, mm. while I'm modern way, I'll get some doggy meat. And then while we're there, we'll check out what spring market has. Yeah, it's no problem. Okay, so we're going to head out. Do you think that the uh, farm roads will be safe with all the rain? Yeah. Okay. Heading to the farm road. Talk to you later, maybe on the way. It's a beautiful day here. 76 degrees, which is such a nice break. Yeah. <clears throat> Refreshing. It was, you know, chilly this morning. I loved it. Wish it would stay like this, but it's not going it's to. Not. That's why we have to enjoy every day that we I know, get. I know, I do. I do. I do. So, we're on. I'm going too slow. I don't know why I'm going so slow today. Deal? There's nothing wrong with it. I don't know. I just. You're just, just enjoying the, 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 the scenery. View. Yeah, it's pretty out here today. I hope you're all doing well in YouTube land, wherever you may be. This is just a Monday. It's the beginning of a new week. It's the dawning of the age of Aquarius. Is it? No. <laughs> I don't know what it is. <laughs> the age of hot weather to come. Don't think about it. Look at the puffy clouds. I mean, it's so pretty. Yeah. It, we had lots of rain last night, so everything's just and the real. Night yeah, two nights in a row. And so everything's green and lush and wet. All the farmers are happy because they pray for it. Because we have some dry spells here that, you know, it's, it's real difficult to 
keep your prop crops good crops but as far as I'm concerned it can be cool every day that's it so I'm gonna go back um, after I shop and I'm gonna try to put out a couple more pieces of jewelry since I've got people that are asking for certain things and um, what are you gonna do when you get home I'll probably get on the the gazelle exercise machine for a little it's bit. It's called a gazelle? Yes. Tony Little's. It's the gazelle. Gazelle. Ooh. And uh, it's out, so I might as well take advantage. I have to do a little bit every day. I hurt. I'm sore, but... Well, that's better than not doing anything. Going. Oh, and just to report, because everyone was concerned about your high blood pressure, I mean blood, oh. blood sugar, it's down. What was it on resting? Every day it's down. Uh, fasting is 138. And, and believe me, that's really good because... Considering it wouldn't get out of the 200s for a long time. Yeah, so you're starting to feel the relief and better. Yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm relieved. <clears throat> me too. I haven't, I haven't had, you know, any kind of junk food. I haven't really had any... The only meat I had was at family night, a little bit of, of the meatloaf, but... Me too. I've been into vegetables and fruits, and that's pretty much what I'm going to get today. I hope Modern Way has some good stuff. I think everything in moderation. Yeah, I don't really, I'm not, I don't feel, I'm I don't have a feeling that I want to eat meat or steaks or anything. No, I don't think I'm going to do steaks. I would if I, you know, could get the grass-fed beef once in a while, but, um, nah, the ones that I can afford are probably the worst ones, you know? You wonder why, oh, the steak's only $6.95. Yeah, can you imagine? Anyway, yeah, I'm kind of sticking to the veggie, mostly veggies and fruits and some. Uh, I'm gonna make get some brown rice. That's Thank you. I'm gonna get. Yeah, beans are good. Beans. I have to. I still have to open that thing up, that box. Got to do that, and I want to get some Anastasi beans to make it. Anastasi, right? Is that you said? In yes, so. modern way, right? Yes. Make sure I get some. I'm gonna get a couple bags. If you don't. I have. I want to show everybody these pretty beans and they're delicious so that's about it we're going to turn the camera off and put some music back on and have a nice drive we're done with our shopping and I thought I'd just say hello again hello again say hello again so we're on our way back home and we're back on the farm road or leaving we're leaving leaving town it was a beautiful shopping experience, wasn't it, Kat? Yes, it was. Rather healthy enjoy, and enjoy, enjoyable. You know, enjoyable. We went to two places and we bought good food, good, healthy. I got lots of veggies and fruit. I got a whole papaya. I got a mango. I got blueberries. I got spinach. I got honeydew. I got spinach. Tomatoes. I lettuce. Got tomatoes. Avocados. Avocado. I don't want to kill this animal. That's a little dog. Oh my gosh. I didn't see it. Well, I did and I wasn't going to kill it. Don't, <laughs> don't mind Sorry, us, people. friends. <laughs> you, that's right. We're a little recording. dog. little yeah. adorable dog come running out of a driveway and I had to make sure I didn't hit it. I didn't. That's the second dog yeah. on this little Never trip that ran out. A little cute dog. It's like, whoa. That would, make, that would really ruin my day my week happen. okay I'm better <laughs> I'm back <laughs> that was so weird yeah so like I'm even reading what's on my dog stuff if I buy something for the dogs now the treats I make sure it doesn't have well, a bunch of sugar I, I always do that but still I've, I've bought pepperoni those pepperonis and stuff yeah they're, started, they're no good I started to get uh, sausage like uh, kielbasa sausage and Debbie reminded me nope Nitrates. Nitrates. Garbage. Yeah. Gotta... Put garbage in. Garbage comes out. Exactly. So I'm putting good stuff in. I'm going to just be like a little saint. <laughs> After a while, it'll, it'll get easier. It, it's not do. as hard as it was last week. So, you know. Yeah. I'm doing good. I got, what else did I get? I got sweet Vidalia onions, which I love. Yeah, me too. And um, I did get a package of this, of organic lentils. And a little thing of red, little red, and red potatoes that I'm, you know, that can be a main course, really. If 
I just carbs. fix things up. Well, you know, I, I definitely like carbs, but at least a lot less than They're I used healthier to. healthier carbs than uh, right. other things. Right. It's not a keto diet. It and, doesn't and, work for well, you. Well, keto, keto was like great, you know, eat, eating pork rinds and bacon and making chicken wings. That doesn't and, sound great. But it did at the time thinking, yeah. oh, yeah, yeah, you know, and I didn't really lose that much weight. And I did lose a little weight, but the truth is I just have to be able to eat organic, whole, you know, good things yeah. from Mother Earth. That's how I want to eat. Yeah. Well, if you're on the treadmill of eating bad foods over and over and if you're just like in the in the habit of it it's very hard to break but I'll tell you once you do it it gets easier day by day it gets easier it and you start to get a feeling like oh wow I can't believe I'm doing this but I'm doing it and I can do it you know yeah and then the candy really, and all that starts to go out of your mind yeah I don't even I just don't and even, I did get some like don't even think natural peanut butter and I'll, I got some um cherry all fruit a polymer so when i get a little urge for something yeah then i then i'll you know that's i've got that yeah um and i also got pickled green beans no was it dilled it, uh, it looks pickled know. pickled green beans pickled. in a jar and some also pickled asparagus spicy and those are good things that if you really feel like you know you want to eat because sometimes i'm an eater and i, I you know it just helps you to just have the snack. right a snacky, yeah. So if I can do it, you guys can do it too. And everybody has their own choices. Some people think the high protein, a lot of meat yeah. and vegetables is the way they want to go. And that's fine, you know. I'm not putting it down. I just, for me, I'm trying a, just, a different path. Just try to make good choices. And Kat's blood sugar is showing her that it's, just, it's, it's working. And um, when we went out of town... Was it uh, now? It's like two weeks ago. Yeah, it feels like she was really feeling bad because the blood sugar makes your whole body tired and run down. And I know mine's been higher than you know it was high too for a while. Not as high as that, but still, I'm feeling better. I feel more energetic. I didn't. I'm. I'm not from going shopping in two different places. Normally, I'd have to like. I'd be bummed. I mean, I'd be tired and, oh my God, I wouldn't be able to, to keep my, couldn't wait to get home and take a nap, you know? I'm not feeling like that anymore, so that's really good. I'm so glad. Took a picture of some flowers that were right near Spring Market, which will be on the end of this video. It's really, they're really pretty. They were, they were gorgeous. And that's what's going on here in our little neck of the woods. Farm road. Which I'm not normally. If it rains a lot, it'll yeah. be flooded. Yeah, this is. A, it I've could been be on dangerous. this road where it was flooded. It's mm. kind of scary to drive through. So if you can't go on this road, you take the. There's a highway through another town Monday, and you can go to the town that we just came from, Haskell. Look at all those piles of stuff. Yeah, they'll burn that. Anyway, so that's what's happening. Just, you know, even if you're out there and you're thinking, well, maybe I better get healthy. If you're all achy and you have arthritis and you're feeling really bad and low, think about what you're putting in. Is, it, is that the reason why we feel bad by the time we get in our, you know, 50s and 60s? I think it is, too. It is the reason what we eat. So we can change that. We really can. And, and yes, there's going to be times when maybe you want to do something special and have a splurge. But not now. I gotta get on this track and stay on it for quite a while. The right and, track. Yeah. I'm so happy that at family night I didn't I didn't uh, feel like I did bad. I did good, considering what other family nights have been. Mm-hmm. <sighs> it's like an eating contest. You know, you just like you take one big plate and then you go back for something you really liked. Not anymore. Whatever's on the plate. That's what I'm eating, period. End of sentence. But at least Nathan and Nadia are kind of on the same path. Yeah. We are. You are. You know, um, it's good because then we start thinking before we make a bunch of junk, cheesy, junky stuff. 
I did buy a whole chicken, <coughs> roasted, you know, rotisserie chicken or whatever they are. But that's my dog gets the, the most of it. I'll probably have some too. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> but it's it's just you know once in a while I get that because they they eat a lot of um, hamburger and cube steak and turkey. So this gives them a little chicken and they love it. I don't blame them. They get the they get the, all the the breast. I give them the best food and they're in good health. You know, looking at all that, those meats and the chicken, off. it just turned me, it did. I just me didn't too. look good to me. No. I guess the whole cooked chicken didn't look bad. Yeah. But yeah, when you look at all the slabs of beef and meat and chicken and pork and sausages. And you know, I was like looking to see if they had any sprouts. No sprouts. No, nothing like that. I wanted some veggie cheese. They didn't have any veggie cheese. We have to like really go. Just gotta make our own sprouts. Like gotta Walmart. Find the seeds. Walmart has at least a little more of, to, you know, offer in that that way. But I really like that market sprouts because it had so many choices. Yeah. I really and I did have the chicken. Uh, I took a video. You'll have a picture of it on here. I like to show you guys what I eat, but I don't always want to do the cooking video. Um, but I, it's called spicy vegetarian spicy chicken patties, like hamburgers. They're veggie burgers. These were made of. Uh, I, I read the back, and it, they were good. I, I sautéed, not sautéed them. I um, cooked them with a little bit of onion and just a little tab of uh, the organic olive oil to just get the pan slippery a little bit. And I made fresh broccoli and squeezed lemon juice on top. And I had one small avocado, which I had to eat because they go bad real fast. And that was it. And I really enjoyed my dinner. So, and I cleaned my kitchen before I went to bed. Yes, hallelujah. Sure makes you feel better when you get up in the morning. I know. When your kitchen's clean. Make coffee and you don't have to, like, move everything. And... Okay, guys. Sharing enough. I can't believe we've spoke for nine and a half minutes. I'll probably edit some of this out because otherwise my videos would be an hour long. And I'm sure you don't want to have a meal in an hour. An hour with RV dips. Talk to you guys at another time. Peace out, friends. Say anything. Peace out. Yep.